so long ago I literally just came back I went to buy a few things and I want to show you guys because we have to talk okay so I picked up these patches picked up some patches because I don't know if you guys remember I've been complaining about this lower back pain for the longest time and it's insane you guys I will get into it later in the evening I mean like it's evening but later when I'm doing my skincare or like trying to settle down we'll talk about this and you know pretty much why I have it but I picked up some patches lidocaine patches and then I also picked up some bathroom soap because we don't have any at all but also tomorrow I have to go out to um, what's it called Marshalls and re-up on a few things so I'm still gonna pick up some bathroom soap but we literally don't have anything like we don't have anything to shower with right now so I had to pick up something for right now so we have that now let me just say that I love this particular one this stuff is really good my favorite it's um, my favorite is the brown sugar from this same brand this is the brand that I use it's not so bad it's affordable but it's also really nice soaps you know um, and majority of their soaps have exfoliating stuff so they have the beads that exfoliate while you're showering and it smells so good it's always so nice and soft so if you haven't tried them before, I will say that definitely um, pick them up when, whenever you see them in the store because they actually do have nice um, shower soaps. So. Now, exciting because I picked up some new wine. Let me show you. I am trying a new wine brand. I'm usually like a Moscato type of girl and I know somebody say Moscato. I know girl. I know. <laughs> I'm usually a Moscato kind of girl um, but I decided that I wanted to try some wine I'm usually the type of girl who is like my wine has to be sweet or nothing else but I've come to realize that you have to be open to trying other wines and I'm not gonna lie it was a day that um, I hanged out with Jax uh, the wine that she gave me it was really nice it wasn't so sweet it wasn't so sour it was like in between and it made me like it gave me that nice wine feeling and that's kind of like why I like drinking wine because it just keeps you in between it's like you're there but you're not it's like you have control of yourself but also you know that you're a tipsy I like that vibe and I don't like like over the top drunk I mean I kind of like that sometimes but I like that when I'm in the comfort of my home or like with my husband you know people that I'm comfortable around but when I'm drinking by myself I'm either tequila or wine so I'm gonna be trying this brand of wine it's called Stella Rosa um, I have never tried them I actually got two um, I got the red and then I got this one over here which is Stella peach so this is Stella cherry black cherry and then this is peach so we're just we'll try them out okay we'll try it out and see what it's giving see what it's saying let me take you guys down a little um, but we'll try it out to see what it's saying but as of right now what I'm doing is I'm cooking I'm making dinner I'm making some yams fried yam and some pork I think will be it'll go great um, with each other so that's what I'm doing right now and then later I would just I feel like I want to tidy up the house because I don't want to do it tomorrow spend my whole Saturday because that's what I always do I'm always spending the whole weekend cleaning the house and then my weekend is gone and then I have to go back to work so my weekend is always like chores 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 so I'm trying as much as possible to see if I can clean the bathroom um, tidy up a few places around the house just so that tomorrow I can have that whole day you know go with Jax buy the things that I have to buy come back home and just chill for the rest of the weekend and not have so much of like a chore type of weekend but I'm not gonna lie this weekend is much more of like tidying up the house getting the house prepped for you know for putting clothes in place and whatnot now with that being said 
last week I have footage of myself um, trying to put my closet together cleaning upstairs folding my clothes all of that I think that I should put it in here I wanted to put it in last week's vlog but I didn't want that vlog to be so long I'm trying to not make my vlogs like over 30 minutes I'm trying to keep it in between that when I do have footage that will go by that over 30 minutes I will give it to you trust me but I'm trying to not like do 30 minutes every time especially when I don't have so much activity going on in the vlog so what I'm gonna do is we're gonna cut from here I'm going to insert clips of me cleaning up my closet you know just taking out some clothes um, you know just folding stuff all of that good stuff closet declutter let me put that right here I hope you guys enjoy that I'm gonna make dinner settle down and then I'll see you guys when it's time to do my nighttime skincare um, so we can chat a little okay let's just watch that and I'll see you hey guys so I am upstairs because I sort of finished doing the office not sort of I finished doing what I wanted to do in the office Ugh. <laughs> I have a lot of laundry to fold um, I still have some downstairs I have oh my goodness that's a mess but my closet's not so bad I'm not gonna lie and it's not so warm here today I'm trying to put you guys down um, it's not so warm today and my closet's also not so bad but I have to still put everything in order because I feel like the better I mean once I have everything in order, I feel a lot more better about myself. You know the song that's all over Instagram? Make me sweat, make me hurt. And like, it's all over my mind. Like, why? Why? Every white pass on Instagram, that song is there. Make me sweat, make me. I'm like, God, please. Like, I do it too. I use trending songs, but now when I hear it, I, I, like, when I get tired, I'm like, oh my God, like, can we be done with this trend already? I still wanna turn up. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> um, but the length is beautiful. I'm not even gonna lie. But it's oh wow. This is sad. <laughs> yeah, I still wanna turn up. All I want is to go again. But you ain't picking your phone up. Why are you messing my head up? Any night, any day. Let me take you away. All I need is just saying yeah, 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 yeah Better nights, better days When you're here with me, babe Cause you're all that I crave So I wonder Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me When I need you most We got love guaranteed And I have got it in summer And I never got to put it on For I don't know why yeah, this one is not so bad so see what it looks like so it's giving like it's bareback but it's like kind of slanted it's cute it's cute i feel like if you have the boobs to fill it it will look um really nice i would prefer i would have preferred if it was like tighter you know much smaller this would be such a nice vacation style dress if you are going to vacation i think it'll be really cool but i also have some new clothes i think i showed you this I'm just gonna put some new um, stuff into it. I can't wait to style this dress for you guys on um, Instagram because it's so cute. It's such a vibe, like it is such a vibe. <laughs> I just can't wait to put it on. I have to hurry up and go and cook. What's the time? God, it's already 6 p.m. Hey, God, it's 6 p.m. Hey, <laughs> goodness, it's 6 p.m. Oh, this dress is so cute. I can't wait to style it, but let me let me put it here because i have a few clothes that i have to style and i want to line them up in a way that i can see them so that when i'm creating content i can just you know pick them up and then i'm good to go and then this is the skims dress that i was showing you guys oh this is i picked it in a size large but i think i should have done a medium because this is big <laughs> this is big but one thing about this dress it will fit you perfectly fine let me see 
Oh, it's actually not bad. It's kind of big, but it's not bad. I'm not gonna lie. Like, it's like very comfortable. And then it goes all the way to the ground. Wow. <laughs> like, all the way. <laughs> so it's cute. I love it. The arms are like really long. So you could, you know, be cute in them. And you guys are seeing my loose skin. I told you guys that I have a lot of loose skin. This dress is big. The dress is big. <laughs> the dress is big. It's in a size large. How is it big? I always wear a size large since losing. Ever since I've lost weight, that's what I've been wearing. I, it, it would be crazy to me if I've lost weight again. And if I'm a size medium right now. Because I don't want to lose weight again. Like I just want to tighten my belly area. And have like tight skin. But I don't want to lose weight again. I'm okay with my body weight right now. But it's cute. It's okay. I'm wearing it at home so I can't be bothered. <laughs> and I honestly think that because I work with Amazon and majority of these things, I just get it from Amazon um, for free. I don't think of like, let me return it and get a new one. Like, it's such a stressful process. <laughs> you know, it's like, it's a gift. So... If it doesn't fit me, I'm going to do the review if it looks cute still and gift it to somebody that is going to look cute on them. So that's just what it is. Um, but guys, I have to, I finished folding everything. I'm not going to lie. I just have um, a few things in the chair here. <laughs> you guys probably see my little plant, but we have a little planter. Uh, you, if you know, you know, okay. And Massachusetts is okay. So if you know, you know, if you know, you know. But I have a few things on the couch that I have to hang up. But in terms of like folding and everything, we folded everything. So, um, yeah, I just have to put the things on the rack and then vacuum, lay my bed. And I think I'm done. But I have to go downstairs and cook. So I will come and do this when I'm done with what I'm doing downstairs. Because I don't want to make a side here. What I say? So let me go and cook and then I'll be back. Okay. But I don't dare to, I'm too fragile And for that I do apologize Maybe someday we can work it out But I'm afraid it's too late to try Baby, I don't dare to love you And you know the reason why Don't you know I'm way too weak to swim? Can't you feel the waves come crashing in? Running out of safety nets Cause every night, every night skincare has become very simple it's like kind of like i think it's like three step or four step i cleanse in the shower i hate cleansing my face over my sink because it gets all over the place my sink is small my bathroom is small obviously you guys um can see that and so when i clean my face here it's just too messy so i like to jump into the shower do it in the shower come out and then do the rest of my skincare it's always so relaxing and so fast so even days when i'm like so stressed out or like tired and i don't have time to do my skincare i know that i could still do it because it's just like two steps or three steps i put on my serum which is like my spray thingy and then i put on my um let me take that back i put on my toner which is my spray thingy i put on my serum and then I put on my moisturizer and some eye cream. I put on my eye cream in the night. I usually like eye cream um, at night as compared to daytime. I still do daytime, but not so much um, like I would do at night. So skincare is done. I also put some topicals in my hair. You guys already know that I have been treating my edges for a while now. Um, and that's the treatment that you guys have just seen put in my hair. I'm currently using the one from Head & Shoulders. I don't know if I told you about it, but... The one that the doctors gave me is here 
I decided to get another one from Head and Shoulders because some review caught me, okay? Some review of Amazon caught me. And then I got that one. I have gone through one bottle. I'm almost done with one bottle. I don't know if I've seen any changes. I'm not so sure. So I think I might just go back to what the doctors gave me. Don't judge me. Don't try to advise me, okay? I am the child that doesn't take advice. If you didn't know, I'm just saying. I'm that, I'm that little sister that never takes advice. Like, I'm just that little sister, okay? <laughs> but anyway, I wanted to talk to you guys about these patches that I have. Because, let me tell you, okay? That over the past few months, I have had the worst lower back pain. And I don't even know. I don't, like, where did it come from? I have no idea initially i had thought when i'm pmsing it's part of the symptoms and so it will go away you know yada yada it's just like a girl stuff thingy so i didn't think so much of it but now it's there like every time when i wake up in the morning and then i sit in my office chair i start to feel this very like strong tension in my lower back and it's not just tension it's tension that actually hits like it feels like pain it's not like it feels like pain it's painful the feeling is painful that's just what it is it's uncomfortable it's painful sometimes i legit want to cry because it's so painful when i try to like bend over like this it is insane so it's been going on for about a month or two i should probably go and see um a doctor but the african in me I'm not gonna lie let me just be vulnerable with you guys the african in me is so scared i'm like i don't know i don't like going to hospitals except when i'm having kids <laughs> don't come for me i know i know i know if you have signs and symptoms you should take it to go checked out i think i will i'm planning of booking myself an appointment maybe in october i'm not gonna lie appointments are so hard to come by um because i don't have a pcp i don't know how I have them if you don't know what PCP is, it's a primary care doctor, like a primary care clinician. Um, I don't have one because I just haven't found the need of looking for one since I have moved down here. Even in Ghana, I didn't have one. So in this country, people have their personal doctors and you know, and whatnot, and you have to have one, but I don't, and I have to have one because obviously insurance requires that you have one. <laughs> so um, I have to look for a doctor. Um, I have to look for a doctor in my area. Plus, I work in insurance now, so I'm very, like, abreast of all the things that I need to do. So I know how I have to go and what I have to do. So I have to look for um, a PCP, book myself some appointment. I don't know what it's going to do or um, what type of appointment it's going to be. But eventually, you guys will see. But for right now, okay, for right now, I did go on Google Hospital because Google is a hospital that I trust, okay? <laughs> She is a hospital that I trust for sure. And Google said to try some ice patches. These patches, they said that it works. Um, they said that when you try the patches for a while and it's still giving you that same pain, I mean, you still have that unbearable pain, then you can go and see a doctor because then you know that even the patches didn't work. So I'm going to try these out. I'm going to put it on my back. Um, you know, I'll just use it for maybe like a week, two weeks, a month-ish. If I feel like I can't do it, if I feel like, you know, this is not working, I will go to a doctor like next week. Knowing myself, I cannot stay with anything that's like uncomfortable. Especially with the type of pain that I'm going through. It's super uncomfortable. It makes me so tired every day. It's just not a vibe, okay? So, I got these today. Um, I decided to get some extras because I'm like... What if it works and then I want more? So this um, this is lidocaine patches. These are pain relief patches, okay? They are supposed to help you, you know, get the pain going. So um, let me put this to the side. I have this one icy hot. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and put this on. Um, just really position it right there. And it lasts, uh, it's supposed to last for about eight hours. I'll work for about eight hours it's currently almost 12 a.m uh it's 11 40 p.m so i'm gonna go to bed anyway so i'm just gonna put this on take to bed come back tomorrow morning i don't think going to bed with it's a good idea because while i'm sleeping it doesn't really hurt that much hmm. but i think it can work while i'm sleeping right 
so that when I wake up in the morning, I can put it to the test. So yeah, I'll just put it on. In my mind, I have to put it on tonight before I sleep. So <laughs> I have to put it on um, and I will update you guys tomorrow on how I feel, generally how it works for me. But the pain is not, it's really and truly not nice, okay? It is really and truly not nice. So this is what the pain, um, the patch looks like. Um, and I really like this because it's big enough so I feel like it can get a big area of my back What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna stretch my I'm just gonna figure out a way to position it I want to position it myself because I feel like I will know exactly where the pain is So I could call my husband but I feel like I want to do it myself So let me Let me do it myself Um So peel pop up eye Okay I'm just gonna yeah, this will be perfect for my entire back. It's so broad. I love it. It's perfect. Let's go ahead and put it on. My hands are so ashy, but I just got out of a shower, so. Oh, please, please don't mess it up. Okay. I can't see my back, but I have a feeling I'm doing it all right. Okay. Oh, it feels very comfortable. It doesn't feel stiff. It, it's very soft, like. Like you can literally flex yourself and not even feel like you have something there. I like it. Okay. Huh. I can start like I, f I smell the menthol and I like I'm beginning to feel the menthol. But yeah, it's right there. Where the pain is, it's not in a good position. So I'm not about to put that on camera, but it's all the way behind my waist. So it's right there. <laughs> Um, but I have it on. I'm just gonna leave it on for right now. Go pour myself some wine Drink that and go to bed chat chit chat with my husband for a little bit He likes to do that. Maybe watch a movie and then we just go to bed. So I'm gonna go to bed. I also got this. Let me show you. I forgot to show you but I also got this stuff right here It's a braid bonnet or braids. I have I have quite a number of you know like Yukus and stuff, but I feel like they don't do the work and All the time I have to pull my braids up to be able to like hold it together and sometimes I just don't want to do that Sometimes I just want to let my hair rest and sleep in that same position So this should do the work for me because with this you don't have to like, you know Put your hair up and all of that. So Let's see what she oh, it literally looks like a sack <laughs> That's so cool but it's so small though. I forget it was going to be way bigger than this. Oh. The idea of it is not so bad. But I like the idea of that. That is super, super easy to put on. <laughs> and I hope that it stays on while I'm sleeping. Because these things, they are known for like coming off while you're asleep. But this is not bad. This is what it looks like. It's not bad. I like it. I like it for braids. And I like it when I don't want to put my hair up. It's perfect. Anyway, you guys, I'm going to go to bed. I feel the menthol. <laughs> I'm excited. I'll let you guys know how it works. Um, I don't know. I'll just update you guys tomorrow. We'll see how um, it goes, okay? But good night. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. It's here! Watch the ball! <laughs> hey, and you are my baby! baby. It's my ball. Oh, my God. Hey, guys. I don't Hi, know if this is there? a good enough angle for I'm you, scared. but happy Saturday. I hate it when I wear this. I feel like I'm going to work at Spectrum, literally. You this, would never wear that at Spectrum. This I've is never my seen uniform you. on Saturdays. Oh, you don't work on the weekend? No, oh, I've never seen you dressed down before. This is my my, my this is my weekend attire. Every oh. every single Saturday, I'm okay. wearing a black top and jeans like every day. I'm I such a jeans. I'm such a uniform type of person. Anyway, hey guys, um, it's Saturday. I'm out here with Jax. We, I, I think I told you guys yesterday that we have to come out to buy a few things. It's going to be a long, exciting one. I'm just so happy because I haven't come out to my house in a long time. But it's raining today, so it doesn't really make it as exciting as I wanted it to be, you know. But Jax is here saying hi to the people. <laughs> Drinking Alani. Oh my god, her energy today is on a whole different level. We're going to go inside. I don't think I can... Do you think I should take the camera? If you want. Isn't it... I always I look know. so weird and people are just always looking at you with the camera and people probably stare at you anyways. Yeah, I know. 
Okay. So I'm gonna go inside with you guys. Um, and we're just gonna buy a few things. Let's go shopping. I gotta pee. Oh my god. Sorry, yeah. guys. <laughs> Look at this little housewife in her G wagon. Get a girl. <laughs> That's gonna be you soon. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I am gonna get a GY because I love that car. See, see how it sounds like it's see. Oh, it's so cute. And that's exactly what I'm going to Now I have already ordered some things from Shein for her, which is it said I had been it had been shipped, so I'm just waiting for that to be delivered. But I'm excited about that order because it has like a lot of cute stuff, okay? But I had to go to Marshalls to pick up some sleeping clothes, you know, loungewear and stuff like that for her because I like Marshalls for that. So let's go ahead and see what we have. So I have this set here. It's so soft. I'm not even going to lie. The fabric for this is so nice and soft. And it comes with a little scrunchie. I don't think she'll ever wear the scrunchie, but it's just a top and down. I like me two pieces or sets from Marshalls. I feel like they are the best, okay? And then I picked up this cute jacket. Jax actually picked up this one because Jackie has a very similar one to this. And it's so cute. So we figured, you know what? This is cute, okay? matching anti-jackets we like it um it comes with a pant i got it for the jacket because you know for days when we're like outside she could wear it um so that there's this one it's also really cute i got it for i got it because of the cute girls on the front of it um but it's also a set it doesn't it's just a two-piece and then i have this jacket this is so cute right this jacket is stinking cute. Um, it's like plush. It's plush over here. And then it has like pink hearts inside. It's cute. I love it. It's just it's just a vibe, okay? It's just a vibe. So she's gonna be wearing this to go out. And I'm excited, but so that's pretty much all that I got, all the clothes that I got from Marshall's for her just so she can like sleep and then you know again the one from the ones from Shein is quite like a bigger order so I'm like you know what I don't want to spend too much on Marshalls because I already spent something on Shein okay and I don't want to spend uh, like another huge money on Marshalls because Marshalls can be expensive sometimes they add up really quickly that's what I was telling Jackie like you think you're picking you know ten dollars ten dollars before you can say Jack it's like hundred dollars and then you're like oh my god well what did I buy <laughs> nothing okay the next set of things that i picked were some candles for mama i'm so happy this one right here oh it's so big i took out the prices because i don't like the white stickers sitting on them i feel like it spoils the whole aesthetic so i took it off there's still a little bit to take off let me just let's just get it off so this particular one is called rogue and I know the color, we were saying that the color doesn't exactly look like, you know, aesthetic. It, it's red, but it smells so good. 
Oh, it smells literally like um, perfume, but not in the most strongest way. It's like, uh, when you smell the lid, it's so nice. It's an exclusive line of fine fragrances, carefully crafted by, yeah, it's, it's perfume by skilled perfumists using premium fragrance oils. So it literally smells like fragrance oil. It smells amazing. It smells so welcoming. I love that. And then we also got another one, this particular one. Tell me that this packaging is not cute. I'm still trying to take off the price, but tell me that this packaging is not cute, okay? Like, this is just cute. Oh, <laughs> like, I remember so well, we both had the same reaction when we smelled this because, oh, it smells so welcoming. I'm not good with, like, notes and whatnot. Let me see if it says what notes it has. It doesn't say it doesn't say but it smells so good it smells so it smells so fresh just like so fresh and so like nice and warm and like like just like a nice hotel room it's giving that vibe and I love it okay so that I also picked up some body oil because I always have to re-up on my body oil from Marshalls. I feel like Marshalls has like a wide range of oils and so I like to try some body oils from them. This particular one is glowing vitamin C body oil so I will just pair this with my moisturizer for the fall season just to give me that moisture. I like adding oils to my moisturizer during the colder seasons. I feel like you know during the cold seasons I can take much more moisture in the summer it's just too hot and you you know like no <laughs> so this is definitely my vibe for the fall and winter now I also got some serum I like trying serums from Marshalls they have different brands that I've never seen before I was looking for vitamin C and hyaluronic acid and then I saw this one it's from a brand called Finley yeah Finley and this is what it looks like it's pretty cute you know just get it going it's not bad um, I also picked up some hand soap for the bathroom this is pumpkin vibe so I figured this would be really nice because um, this one has hair long pumpkin with essential oils I don't know what hair long pumpkin is but I think it's hair long or hair I don't know I don't know how to say the word but it smells like pumpkin spice kind of vibe not so strong it's in between so I feel like this will be nice for the bathroom and also it will bring like the fall vibes into the bathroom so it's cute I like it I picked up some moisturizer this is coconut body moisturizer I honestly don't have a specific moisturizer that I use I just use anything that is nice and refreshing and moisturizing enough to keep me going so every time I have a different moisturizer and this is the one I'm gonna have um, for the next months or so I'm gonna pair this with a body oil and just use that for my body care and then I picked up some facial razors because I needed that this comes in a pack of 12 and this was six dollars so this is definitely a good save keeping that now the next thing that I have I picked up some mats for the bathroom because I need a new mat and this is so nice and plush like it's so nice and soft so I can it's a it comes in a set of two we actually picked this up at Walmart I didn't pick this up from Marshalls this was from Walmart I feel like I like Marshalls um, Walmart for these kind of things towels and stuff like that Walmart is definitely um, the place for me so this is gonna go into the bathroom and then this for in front of the toilet just so that we can switch up the one that we have as you can see I'm going for um, much more of like a neutral nude kind of tone in the bathroom because I'm about to clean it up I have some new um, hardware for the bathroom you guys will see me install that in a little bit but it's black and I feel like it will go really well with this so I'm excited that's pretty much everything that I picked up today I didn't really pick up much I really did go for Harper's clothes and to re up on some beauty stuff that I wanted for the house and some things that I usually get at Marshalls every now and then so that's just all I have I'm back home I'm not gonna lie I'm just gonna chill for a second breathe sit down chit chat I like to do that <laughs> uh, before I get into doing anything else the next thing that I feel like I have to do is install a wallpaper let me show you 
I got a wallpaper from Amazon. I think I have showed you guys this in a previous vlog, but I want to put this in the kitchen because this whole area where I cook, there's just so much stains on the wall, cooking stains on the wall. I don't think it's cute. And I don't, because it's a rental, I don't want to paint over it again. So I just figured a wallpaper would be nice. So I'm going to install this later today um, and, you know, just sort of switch up the kitchen a little. So I'm going to be doing that. But for right now, I just want to breathe, chill, relax. So let me do that. And I'm going to come back to see you guys in a second, okay? Mm. How did it go? I spent it in Yeah. Hey you guys, good morning. Um, it is a whole new week. I am currently about to end the vlog and I just wanted to say that I will include a little bathroom makeover in next week's vlog for you guys because I don't want this vlog to be an hour. It's already 40 minutes. So thank you guys so much for watching. I love you and I will see you guys in my next one. All right, bye. Why don't you tell me that you got